We're in Ulversund in the southern part of Norway. And uh, more than 1,000 years ago, a ship tried to get into this sheltered harbor, but didn't make it and ended up on the seafloor. We are here to try to understand more about what happened when the ship sank and what kind of ship this was. This, this wreck site was located by sports divers uh, several years ago and uh, my main interest was then uh, export and trading from Norway during Viking Age and medieval times. The ship sank more than 1000 years ago. This means it's the oldest shipwreck ever found in Norway and the only shipwreck from the Viking Age. And the reports from sport divers was that there was, uh, they had seen a lot of grinding stones on the seafloor here. This makes it extremely interesting for us to try to find out more about the ship, what happened and what, how they built ships that time. This is a real treasure trove for us uh, marine archaeologists. We are working on an area approximately 14-15 meters long trench. We are using divers and a dredge system to excavate the sediment uh, underneath the grinding stones that were located uh, on top of the seafloor. And then we found a piece of uh, antler from reindeer. And the dating of the antler showed that this was the oldest shipwreck ever found in Norway, dated back to year 1000. We uh, was quite excited because reindeer is uh, some of the goods that we know that they were traded with in the Viking times. And then we, we found a lot of other stories, for instance ceramic from uh, medieval times, and so this it shows that this is a site where there have to be a lot of shipwrecks during all these years, so it's a quite a big puzzle. We are looking for more parts of the shipwreck or from the cargo itself. And we're hoping to find more evidence of the shipwreck uh, hidden in the sediment.